Community leaders are launching a new initiative to transform Amarillo into a global food hub. Camarillo Force Princess Bryant has more on the regional accelerator and new growth engine for the range. That's in tonight's High Plains Agriculture. According to officials with the Regional Accelerator and New Growth Engine, the launch of the range will lay the framework for Amarillo to become a world leader in facilitating research, developing programs, and creating technology that addresses present and future challenges in the beef, dairy, and crop production industries. Executive Director for the range, Matt Gardner, explains why the range project decided to launch in Amarillo. We're unique to the world in that we have the largest concentration of, of bovine production in the world and uh, it would only make sense, right, for us to try to innovate where the production is. Bob Gills, the range senior advisor, says that he was drawn to this project due to growing up in a rural community in North Carolina. He says he understands looking for economic opportunities in a place like Amarillo. Great places of innovation like the range are built on partnerships. So the relationship between the range and uh, WT and Amarillo College and Texas Tech will be about linking their research, the talent of their students, combining it with industry, and creating whole new economic opportunities and job creation. Vice President of the range, Laura Street, talks about one of the biggest challenges the range is currently facing. Particular point is getting everyone to think that we can do something far bigger and better than what we have and we are today, and to think about the future of food production and how that needs to change because our world is changing so fast around us. We want to be part of that conversation. Street says that the community needs to start thinking beyond Amarillo in the panhandle because if not, we're going to be at a standstill. She adds that together, Amarillo could benefit and become more efficient, effective, it could create an ecosystem of innovation. Live in studio, Princess Bryant, KMR Local 4 News, Jack. Princess, thank you. Jill says that Amarillo has so much character and history, and the range wants to make sure that they embrace it in the project.